What's up everybody and welcome back to another episode of True's Pokemon Omega Ruby Forever Wedlock. In the last episode we took on the gym leader Watson in Mallville City and in today's episode we're gonna go and explore some of the city and uh, do whatever comes to mind. So pretty, <laughs> pretty much that's what's going down today because I have not explored Mallville yet. Um, not even on my Alpha Sapphire so I have no idea what's going down in this town. Welcome, young one. Have you ever heard of reflexology? This is where the Pokemon can receive a mas massage treatment. No, we don't. We don't want none of that. We don't want you touching my Pokemon. I don't know what you're going to do to them. With your weird hands. <laughs> Would you like to trade Pokemiles for prizes? Okay, cool. So we can trade Pokemile for prizes here. You guys probably already know what all this stuff is, but I'm just, you know, I'm interested. A mirror store. Let's f somebody find a Tauros. Basically, we deal in mirrors and mirrors alone. Interesting. Um, okay. Well, I think that obviously has to do with the Landorus, Thunderous thing you bobber, like she was saying. I don't really know. What's this? Oh, come on. Come on, True. Come on, Norsey. What are... Norsey. Behave. There we go. A metal blend of coffee and music. Um, no thank you. Oh, guys, by the way... Um, just to recap, we ended up grabbing Outage and bringing him to our team, along with Salvatore. Um, the next gym leader is... What's her name again? Flannery, the fire gym leader. Um, which means, uh, upsettingly, once again, Salty and Trouble look like our best pair. So, <laughs> once again, they're leading the charge. Um, but I do want to train up Salvatore and... Uh, I want to train up Salvatore in trouble, so maybe I'll do that in today's episode off screen. Or not off screen, but sped up. I don't really know. And we already got our bike last episode. If you guys haven't noticed, it's been a while since I've recorded this again. Um, I keep taking these breaks because I just, I've been so tired in stuff. But uh, no excuses. We're here now recording, so. Hey there, trainer. This is your first time here, right? This food court is a bit strange, so there's a, there are some rules you have to follow before you can eat. I come here all the time, so I can tell you about them. Number one, place your order at the counter. There are three items on the menu here, so order whatever you like. I feel like I would get sick of eating the same three foods all the time. When you're done ordering, the restaurant staff will give you a buzzer. Number two, sit in a chair while you wait for your food. It may take a while for your order to be ready, so have a seat and wait. Here's the important part. While you're sitting and waiting for your food, others will come and battle you at your seat. You have to fight back if you want to eat your meal. <laughs> what? That's so weird. Number three, eat your food. When the buzzer goes off, it means that your order is ready to be picked up at the counter. All that's left to do then is to sit back and eat. So what do you think? Easy, huh? Uh, well, you've come all this way here, so why don't you get something since it's your first time here? Maybe you should order the Village Sub Combo. The restaurant is a chain from Unova that just opened here. It's easy to eat, so it's pretty popular with the kids, the single battles, blah, 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 blah. All right, bro. You talk a lot, man. Uh, maybe we'll give it a shot. I want to test and see what levels they are first. You know what I mean? That looks like hot dogs. Uh, you selling hot dogs? Would you like to order the village sub combo? Oh, no, she's ordering subs. Okay, so this is what the kid told us to do, so we'll do it. I don't know if we gain XP or not from this, so it should be interesting to, to find out. Yo, bro. Hey, stay away from that chair. I saw it first. <laughs> what a little jerk. Wow, what a brat. We're getting bullied by, by Cutler here. He's got his his slugma. You ain't, you ain't got nothing. You ain't got nothing. Alright, so his Pokemon are level 17. I just want to see how we're looking on other people. So we could potentially use this as a training opportunity. I'm not too sure. Um, maybe for Ezio, because Ezio is pretty high level. But we're just going to go for a bite, because I think... Yep, one hit wonder again. One hit wonder. Man, Trouble, you are straight power recently. All right. So cool. I wonder how many people we have to battle, though. Well, I lost, so there's nothing but... Uh, he'll look for a chair somewhere else. Cool, cool kid, cool kid. Oh, the seat's, 
here have been have to be won, okay? The world of food is harsh too. <laughs> These people, no manners. Keep your elbows off my table. Oh yeah, you don't stand a chance. I'm sorry, but you don't stand one chance. Nope. Get fire fanged. Dunzo. So after this, we'll probably do oh, that reminds me. Time or time, time or time. We will probably do a speed up montage of DOS training. Da, 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 da. So I have to set my timer. As always, I've forgotten to do this. It's just tradition at this point. It's tradition. Can't break tradition. If you lose, you can't sit down to eat. The world of food is really harsh. <laughs> that it is. Just three turns left till your meal is ready to be eaten. Alright. Didn't you already come up with... Didn't you already do this? Didn't I teach you your lesson already? Oh no, he's Ham. His name's Ham, man. Wow, his name is a food. Have their names all been food? Maybe Cutler was actually Cutlet. And that, that would be a food. I don't really know. But, I mean, none of this is any issue for trouble. And it was really hard for me not to say any trouble for trouble there. But I'm working on not saying that every single episode. <laughs> Too bad, I wanted to sit in that chair. Too bad is right. Norsey, check the buzzer. Just two turns until your meal is ready. So do we have to fight two more people? Really? What if I... Okay, so if I, leave, if I make this battle last a little bit longer, will the battling be over? I'm not really sure. A Goldeen. Are you for real? I'm gonna make this into dinner. I'm gonna make you into dinner. We're gonna eat you. I'm just gonna eat you up. Yeah, we actually didn't come to this food court for me to eat. We came here for trouble to chow down on some things. That's the way it's looking. Alright. Hurry up. Let's get this over with. I just want my sub, man. I want my sub. Eat fresh. Alright. Oh, she's going to curse us. Ooh, 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 what's her name? I bet she was a food. By fairy tale girl Maggie. Ma Maggie? Interesting. Interesting. Dun, da, 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 da. Um. Let's just fire fang you. I don't even care. Let's just do it. Yep, still one hit. <laughs> Still one hit. Oh man, we're almost level 23 also. That's pretty crazy. By the way, the level limit for the next gym, if I didn't already say it, is 33, I believe. Alright. Her chair her chair was defiled. That's great. Oh, there we oh. Jesus, this is a crazy buzzer. Shakes the entire world. That's crazy. Sorry to keep you waiting. Here's your village sub combo. It's ready and fresh from the oven. Man, if you knew all the fighting I had to do to get this thing, and we obtained a nugget, that's awesome. Sweet. And a, ma a mago berry. Interesting. Okay. Well, thank you very much. I'm going to sit in my rightfully earned chair and eat this thing. Thank you. Nice. Okay. Well, that was fun while it lasted. Let's, uh, let's throw that in the trash, apparently. Okay, cool. That entire... Uh, that entire tray we'll just throw in the trash because that's that's how it goes. <laughs> that's how Norsey does things. All right, so that was kind of cool, a little fun thing to do in Mallville. I don't know, maybe I'll do the training next episode and just sort of do everything Mallville this episode because it looks like there's a lot to do. Sup, this is the move tutoring dojo. You got any Pokemon from a professor? Makes no difference if it's gone ahead and evolved into something else since. As long as it's real friendly toward you, I'll teach it an unbelievable move. Want to learn the battle combo move? Um, do I? Man, this Pokemon, it's nowhere near friendly enough to you. Try again, yo. What do you mean it's not friendly enough toward me? Trouble loves me. I love Trouble. I don't, I think he needs to be the starter Pokemon though, didn't he say? Oh my god! Alright, well maybe we'll have to work on happiness. <laughs> maybe we'll do some some uh, Pokemon of me 
Learn moves through dance. This is the move tutoring studio ultimate. We can teach mo ultimate moves through dance, darling. That's what we do. Tell me, darling. Shall we teach your lovely Pokemon some moves? Yeah. Oops a daisy, none of your lovely Pokemon can learn ultimate moves. We're pretty exclusive about who we take in as students. Man, people in this town, they're real they're real sleaze balls. What is this? Same old battles got you down, turn it up with the inverse battle shop. Uh battle shop, or was it stop? I don't want to battle people. I want to okay, let's see. The revolutionary inverse somatic machine. Venture can create No. Hey you kid. You know about the ability called Mold Breaker? Yeah, I know about the Do I know about the ability Mold Breaker? Get out of here. Get out of her. Talking down to me. Talking smack. Test your battle mellet. I mean metal. <laughs> Oh, that's too funny. Alright, let's go up these stairs. I want to investigate the top floor now. What's up, bro? Hey, what are you staring at me for? I have to wait here for Genesect. Oops, forgot I just said that. Forget I just said that. Oh. Alright, well then, um... Good luck with that, because I don't think he's going to, uh... Do these people battle us? <laughs> I almost want to start... Leveling Queen up, just because I feel bad for her. And I think Ezio can take on the people of this town. As long as she doesn't have electric types. Oh, okay. She doesn't... Hey, Squirt, you like Pokemon? Yeah. You really like them? Yeah. Would you even say you love them? Yeah. You really say you love them? Yes. Then I'll give you this. Take it. A Poke toy. Oh, thank you. I'm so... I'm so happy. Oh, look at Taylo. It's a friend for you. Oh, Ezio, it's your friend. Say hi. What's up with this sketch ball? Hey, kid, listen to this. I got this here metronome that was used by a super famous musician. If you're really desperate, I can guess I can give it to you for a thousand dollars. How about it? Um. Sure. <laughs> Sir, sure, strange man selling uh, famous people's things on the black market. I will take that from you and yeah, stuff about the paparazzi. Nobody cares. Oops, wrong thing. We should probably leave the XP share on though. I just want to see if there's like any hidden items, no? You know what I'm saying? Plus these things are just look so cool. This is the new fashion statement. You gotta wear the uh <gasps> You gotta wear these around town if you wanna be cool. Oh Yay! We got a luxury ball. See, this is why all the cool kids are wearing these these days. I want to see what this old lady has to say because she looks very, like, suspicious. I'm an old busybody. What of it? I'm not shy in telling people nice folks. Uh, now then, whisper snapper, get on that PSS and start handing out O powers. Ah, uh, no, we don't want to hand out O powers. So. All right, old lady. I thought you were going to be a lot cooler than you were. We don't have any O powers to give because I haven't been stopping to get them. That's my... Oh. Oh, oh no. Oh, it's Wally's dad. Okay, hand please. Oh wait, no, never mind. Just a guy handing out nuggets. A mighty fine nugget, all yours now. Hope it pans out for you. Ha ha ha, gold pun. There's nothing funny about nuggets. <laughs> oh my god. There's everything funny about nuggets. And you made a pun. He hopes it pans out for you, that was the pun. Because when you're when you're looking for gold, you pan it in your 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 pan to see if you got any. It was a it was a pun, good pun, man. I appreciate. It. Youngin, take a look at that. Oh no, ouch! But Tello is a lone lucky one, way up high with the touch of the wind ruffling its feathers. What what are you going on about, you crazy coot? All right. Alright, cool. I think we've done a lot of exploring of Mallville. Um, it turns out there's no... Oh, look at this Rhydon, man. You you a Rhydon racer? Why would anyone ride on this kind of thing? <laughs> oh, I guess not, man. I guess you ain't. Can I can I ride him? Oh, it's it's not a real Rhydon. It's a fake Rhydon, guys. It's a fake Rhydon. We should probably stock up on some uh, stuff at the market down there. I was hoping there was going to be Pokeball shops and stuff here, but... I didn't see any, so 
Oh well. I wonder if that guy's waiting for Genesec too. Da, 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 da. What's this? Oh, it's an empty shop. Maybe we can set up our own shop there. Make some say, some moolahs. You gotta check this. You gotta. Nope, it's empty. Just it was calling to me. All right. So, oh no, is that where I meant? Yeah, this is where I meant went that I meant to go. There we go, English. There we go, English. Um, I would like to buy some stuff. Let's see, we have 15 Pokeballs. We only got two Great Balls. Sure, let's buy two of those. And then let's buy... Oops. <sighs> silly me, silly me. Let's buy an Ultra Ball or two. Maybe, maybe four. Yeah, let's buy four Ultra Balls. And, oops. Uh, I always do that. I always click B one too many times. Alright, so potions, we got four. We have no Super Potions. We need some of those for sure. Let's just get, like... Nine. Oh man, that was all of our money. I feel dumb. No, guys, you made me broke. Let's just sell the nuggets, man. Sell them nuggets. Do I? Oh, oops. <laughs> I should look at my bottom screen for this. All right. Thank you. Yep, yeah, we needed that desperately. We need some moolah. No, that's it. All right. So let's. Bounce out, we'll heal up our Pokemon, and then we'll... Hmm... Maybe we'll backtrack in preparation for the next episode's training montage of sorts. You know, we can go backward to the Trick House now that we have Rock Tomb. No, Rock Smash. Rock Smash. We can backtrack to there, um, which could be cool. But, I don't know, I really need to do some training uh, to train up these these Pokies that are, that are really falling behind. And I, you know, I can't, I gotta, I gotta get them right. I don't want to lose any more, el anyone else in this LP. So, two Pokemon is enough for me to lose. Oh, also, I uh, believe Pokemaster, I'm not sure if it was Pokemon. Everybody glare at this guy. <sighs> you little brat. You killed my Pokemon. Um, Pokemaster, I believe it was Pokemaster. If not, I'm sorry, whoever really did it said that um, we could get the Manetric Ite, oops, underneath the bike path. And I don't know if it's on the bike path or under the bike path. I don't know how to get there. Oh. Who do we have first? I don't know. Beauty Melissa sent out Goldeen. Shouldn't be much trouble, though. Queen. Okay, we got Queen out. All right, all right. Um, we should probably switch to Ezio. <laughs> I forgot that we put Queen out first. That's not good. Horn attack. Ooh. Oh wow, that did some damage. That did some damage. All right, let's just go in with a wing attack. Yeah, we'll keep out. Oh, gosh. As long as she doesn't get a crit, we should be okay. Oh, nice, nice. You got this, you got this. Survive, survive, survive. Yes, yes. Alright, now let's just go for that quick attack, finish her off, and we should be golden. Oh, I forgot EXP shares on. Oops. Oh, Treble got the 23, though. That's cool. Yeah, because, um... Flannery's Pokemon have level 28 is her max level. So we gotta do a lot of training on our guys. Oh, there it is. That's cool. So now if we end up evolving Electric into Manetric and all that stuff, we can Mega Evolve him. Because, guys, this is something I wanted to point out was that... Um, does Mega Evolving count as a evolution? I'm gonna say no, solely because... Uh, let's see... It, it de he de evolves after the battle, so it's not like a permanent thing. So I'm gonna say, unless you guys completely disagree with this, um, if I get a Pokemon that can Mega Evolve and we get him to his final ev evolution, so he can Mega Evolve, we're going to be able to do it. 
unless you guys think differently. So guys, let me know in the comment section below whether you think that's fair or not. Um, as for this episode, it's done. So thank you guys so much for watching and all the continued support. A couple episodes ago, we hit 31 likes or something, which is absolutely crazy. And I appreciate that so much, guys. So thank you for watching. And as always, peace out.